How political are you these days following the American presidential election? More political than I've been in other elections. More, I, I feel more political. Mm. Because I feel as if we have a chance to have a completely different government, a uh, different outlook on the world. Mm -hmm. And I think we need a new vision mm -hmm. and a new policy and a new, a new way of looking at the world. And so we have a chance to do that. In my lifetime, we've had very few chances. Mm -hmm. In the 1960s, we had Kennedy. Yeah. And he, he was an inspirational figure. To my mind, he was the last inspirational figure that we had. Yeah. Now we have uh, McCain, mm -hmm. Obama, and Hillary. Mm -hmm. Hillary is somewhat inspirational, but Obama is more inspirational. So mm -hmm. imagine someone with Obama's life story. Yep. As a possible as a president, mm -hmm. we've never had a president even that slightly resembled him. Mm -hmm. Where he came from, where he's been, how he was raised by his mother, mm -hmm. um, who he represents, the kind of racial divide that he could mm -hmm. he could bridge. Mm -hmm. So, uh, I think that's a very exciting. We live in a very exciting time. So sometimes you can get very depressed and you say, "Oh, same old process. Yeah. Oh, it'll never happen." But an inspirational figure, someone that you believe in, someone mm -hmm. that has a sense of humor, intelligence, and a different way of looking at the world is a wonderful thing. So you vote for Obama? I w yes, I'm inclined to Obama very, very much. And I felt this way about Clinton, though, you know, when, when mm -hmm. Bill Clinton. Yep. When Clinton got elected, I thought, we have a chance. And, and actually, when Clinton, as a president, was a fair man. Our economy was buoyant. We had a, a surplus in money. Yep. His taxes were a bit higher, but People were generally, we had a good feeling. Are you a Democrat or Republican? Do you know, I started life as a student agitator. Oh, yeah? Yes. In the 60s? Uh, yes. During the Vietnam War? Yes. And you, was, you were part of the anti-Vietnam War movement? Anti-Vietnam carrying signs. Yeah, yeah. You were wearing long hair as a hippie? Yes. So, when you ask a uh, Republican or Democrat, I smile because I feel, in my heart, I'm still a student agitator. <laughs> so, I would rather be in, in, in front of the White House carrying a sign uh -huh, uh -huh. than inside the White House. Right. So, I feel as if that it's my duty not to be mm -hmm. part of any political party. Right. I'm inclined toward Obama as, as it... Uh, so, you have voted uh, for both parties? In no, the no, I've never, <laughs> I've never voted for a Republican. No, no. Right. Uh, that I can recall. No. Mm -hmm. The last election, I voted for Ralph Nader. Yeah, I was going to ask you. Ralph Nader has come back again for this I election. I like Ralph Nader. And Are I you going to vote for him this time again? Probably not. I don't <laughs> think he has a chance. But because but, someone said to me, uh, "Well, who did you vote for, Al Gore?" I said, "No, I voted for Ralph Nader, <laughs> the Green Party." The Green Party. Why did you vote for him when he had no chance to win? So that I could justify it to myself mm -hmm. and I could say at least I voted for the right man. I voted for the man that I truly believed in. Although he would never be. make it to the White House. Yes, but I wanted him to get as many votes as possible uh, and, and, he, and one of them was mine. And he took away El Gore's victory. Mm, they, I don't think so. No? I don't think so. Mm -hmm. People said that, but Ralph Nader is an extremely interesting man mm -hmm. and he is a totally moral man mm -hmm. that mm -hmm. he's never taken any money mm -hmm. and his view of uh, corporate funding of uh, uh, manufacturing mm -hmm. of pollution I, er, er, on every mm -hmm. subject mm -hmm. I agree with him maybe he's too clean for politics uh, too good for politics poli possibly possibly mm -hmm. but uh, I'm not going to vote for him this time no um, because you don't think he will I made my point <laughs> you made your point <laughs> once it's enough I made my point I think I would like to be able to criticize both parties. Mm -hmm. if, I'm, if you say I'm a Democrat, I don't want to be a Democrat and say, you know, it's like saying, my mother right or wrong, my country right or wrong. Right. My mother, whether she's drunk or sober, <laughs> is still right. My mother, yeah. Even if my mother's drunk, 